It's great to hear the speakers. We've had some amazing speakers already this morning. But overall, to me, the value of the scheme is the networking. It's meeting people from across the company. It's not about where you sit in the organisation. We're all equal as FDE and fellows, so we can meet together and discuss and learn from each other. As a fellow, at seeing the new distinguished engineers um, being nominated and going through that nomination process and then receiving their new, uh, the awards, uh, just is great in the evening, it's a real celebration. So uh, all the way through I'm looking forward to it. The really key thing is that the FD scheme provides a network of technical people across the company, it, it crosses organisational boundaries and now with the arrival of the EMEA and America's FDEs, it now provides networking across country boundaries as well. So this is really important, this is a really important mechanism for binding together the tech community and enabling them to work together and help each other and so forth across a large part of Fujitsu. For me it means it gives you kind of an extra spring in your stride because you're recognised by your peers as doing an excellent job and it then motivates you to kind of excel even further in your profession. In my eyes, it gives you a higher level of importance and, and competency and it, it puts you above the, the competitors. I see it as an absolute competitive advantage to highlight the competencies, the intelligence, the commitment and the loyalty that you have from your employees. Well, the highlight of my, of, for me was the uh, talk of Eddie. That was really energizing, especially this uh, thing with make your hands dirty and also your brains. Uh, sorry, Joseph, that's not your talk, but you know what I mean, I think. <laughs> the scheme makes sure that our best technical minds in the company work with each other, but not just with each other to share knowledge and experience, but also contribute back to the company, further our causes, but not just in the community they live in, but also contribute to the progress of society and the country they live in. We need distinguished engineers to show and, and to demonstrate to our customers that Fujitsu is a services-oriented company with technology at the heart of it. Oh, this was very inspiring because um, I didn't know what science, uh, what the status of the science is, what, um, what the future will bring and what's um, possible today. And therefore, I think I can help my customers better um, to use these ideas and to make their own um, solutions out of it. So I know where to grab and where, where, where the possibilities are. So I got very inspired. So the highlight is really the networking, meeting so many people, finding about how they solve solutions in their regions, learn from them. Uh, I particularly enjoyed the Dr. Reger presentation in the morning and how he clearly explained how, what he expects from the FDEs. Well, I think it's always nice to be recognized and I think it gives you a bit more gravitas in, in people's ability to understand that you are an expert in your field. Um, what I would like to do with it is to use the, um, the badge to help push more females as well into engineering and to spread the word and get communication improved throughout the organization. We have a number of co-clubs that are run through Fujitsu staff being volunteers and they've got a taste of the kinds of things that coding and programming can do to inspire and create. And we have a really simple model that enables a volunteer to go into a school or a library or a community centre and for one hour a week provide resources to enable kids to make games and animations and learn different programming concepts each week. How would you behave differently if the world was really digital? How would your day look? How would you interact with your colleagues? Out of all of this, as a distinguished engineer, you feel proud of yourself having led, having connected, and having really accelerated the process of digital transformation.